like, yo, shout out to Tom, son, because we really needed some. We need songs like this because us everyday citizens who just work and make the keep the keep the um the gears turning in America, we are heroes, son. <laughs> What's good, you guys? Your boy Dipset Dip to the MO back at it like a crack at it with these mathematics soft fabric. So I do cause steady, and we here. What another reaction, man? Today, just like six, seven minutes ago. Tom McDonald dropped the video for Heroes. Why am I talking like <laughs> I ever heard the song? Never heard the song. This is fresh for me. But I've been recommending this video plenty of times. <laughs> Everybody was recommending me this shit, son. And telling, yo, it's 12 o'clock. It's 12 o'clock. All right, let's get into this shit. So, shout out to y'all. Shout out to the hogs. You heard. Big HOGs. You heard. Respectfully. But let's get into this shit. If you fuck with the content, please like, comment, subscribe. If you want me to react to any one of your videos or review one of your videos, even if it's your personal music or whatever the case may be, please comment below or hit my TikTok. Let's get into this shit. Shout out to Big Tom. You heard Big Tom? Hot game, you heard? There's too many songs about diamond teeth and gold chains. Too many rappers who still glorify gangs. There's way too many rhymes. Chill, bro. Chill. You already taking shots at me, bro? This is my brand, bro. I ain't no gangster, you heard? But anyway, shout out to you, Tom. <laughs> about codeine and women, we'd like to bang. Facts. Just wanted to make a song to say thanks. Thank you to the cops who really trying to make the world a better place. Risking their lives to keep a man they never even met safe. Facts. They ain't trying to kill your kids or lock their father away. They got families who need food on their plates. And thank you to the firefighters. Whenever I hear sirens, I pray. It takes a special kind of man to run toward all the flames. When Facts. we see smoke and we need help, the fire can't be contained. They're running in while everybody runs away. And thank you to the soldiers fighting for us, flying way overseas. I ain't never met you, but I love you because you're dying for me. Uh -huh. I'm enjoying my freedom, and I know freedom ain't free. Well. Sorry, yeah, you know I gotta put my little, my little conspiracy theory. In. A lot of the times, the soldiers are not fighting for our civil duty and civil nature, and where we, where we live it as citizens, they're fighting for the higher ups. You know who I'm talking about? <laughs> like they fighting for the higher ups, and most people, both people on both sides of the wars are getting bodies dropped and blood spilled because the higher ups are beefing with each other, but they pussy. You feel me? Them niggas is soft. Them niggas don't want to... Them niggas don't want to... They, they, you, you'll never see the ones who start the war in the field. Because they pussy. Fuck what you talking about? It take real men to go out there and really... Well, feel like you're defending your country. You heard? Of course, there's been times in real war. Civil war. It was a civil war and like the... um Viet, Not Vietnam. I don't count the Vietnam war. The, when, when, what's that joint? With, um, with Japan Jack, attack Pearl Harbor? Okay, that's what was like really fighting for our freedoms and all that. But most of the time, especially nowadays, bro, it's a money grab. Money and land grab. That's all wars is. Money and land grab on the death and blood of American citizens and citizens across the world. But anyway, talk your shit, Tom. I see what you mean. When the anthem plays, I don't take a knee. And thank you to the truckers, the janitors, and the average people. The ones holding the jobs that will damage your... See? Hold on. Sorry. <laughs> see, I get, I get when people went back when Kaepernick took the knee. But American soldiers were saying this is they fought for their right for him to take the knee. So the narrative was switched by the media to make it seem like he was disrespecting all of America when he was just disrespect he was just protesting against the police brutality that was going on. It wasn't about disrespecting American soldiers. Because most American soldiers was like, Oh, we stand with Cap. We fought for him to be able to do that. Feel me? Once they spit the narrative, everybody, like, oh my god, he's coming against the country, you need to leave. People don't, you know, people don't comprehend very well. <laughs> and it's easy, like I said in the earlier videos, it's easy to manipulate people. Easy to manipulate people. If you keep saying the, seeing the same thing with the same narrative all the time, you're going you're gonna to end up believing that shit. But anyway, sorry. Ego. The ones who do the most and in return they get zero. Facts. Do what anyone says. Y'all are heroes. Everyday people, they know who they are. They aren't superstars and they don't fight evil. They got to do the hour. With no superpowers Facts. Everyday people Don't always save the world They don't get the girl But y'all are heroes I feel this man heroes. I'm a hero Side note Sidebar I know I'm stopping I'm sorry But y'all probably heard this song already I just didn't see the video I apologize again though On my days When I'm not When I'm working I do night shift I'm a paratransit driver Right now, my shift is helping the homeless community in New York City bring them, into, bringing them into the homeless shelters and stuff like that. Feel me? So, 
Thank you. Thank you, Tom. I am a hero. I'll be feeling, yo, I'll be feeling good. Even though I'll be tired as hell. <laughs> I'll be tired as hell, but I'll be feeling good helping the people, son. Shout out to my homeless brother. I met a vet the other day, too. A homeless veteran. He from the, what war was it? It was the, um, he was an old dude, son. Whatever the war before the Iraq war. But he was a real older dude. He was probably like 70-something, son. Like, you feel me? He was just so nice. A kind soul. And then he just, you know, told me his story. I don't want to get into detail. That's his business. But and I was just like, damn, bro. Like, why is he in this situation, son? Why is he in this situation? He literally fought for this country, went hard, and he's homeless? Feel me? Lost everything, son. Like, I almost cried, son, respectfully. But, you know, my man Rage no bitch, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't laughing at the brother. Don't don't mistake that from laughing at the circumstance the brother was going through. But yeah, man, shout out to him. Hopefully, when he go through the shelter, he find a he get a home because, well, especially nowadays in New York, these illegals who's up here they give they giving them motherfuckers homes like this. They go in the shelter for two weeks and they get a home. But veterans and people who've been in New York City for the longest, or homeless people who've been in the city for years, are still stuck in shelters. It's fucked up. But let's go, Tom. Too many songs about Xanax and faces covered with tattoos. What? Xanax and faces covered with tattoos. What the fuck is that shit on the side of your face? Way too many asses on camera with rap dudes. Too much Gucci, Louis, Prada, clothing, trying to brand you. I just want to make a song to say thank you. Appreciate thank you, you to the paramedics coming at high speed in an ambulance. Facts. Trying to get someone to breathe at the scene of an accident. Covered in a stranger's blood and trying to bring them back again. Their stress level's always at a maximum. Thank you to the carpenters, mechanics, and the welders mm -hmm. and plumbers. Y'all are building all the roofs that we're under. I used to be a roofer, man. Union 8. Union 8 local. Wait, Union 8. Local 8. Union and, um... It was in Long Island City, New York. You feel me? I missed that shit, son. It was hot as fuck up there. Feel me? I should should I put some pictures up? I still got some pictures of myself on the roof. Feel me? Just cover my face and all that. But yeah, man, I missed that shit. Yo, like, yo, shout out to Tom, son, because we really needed some. We need songs like this because us everyday citizens who just work and make the keep the keep the um the gears turning in America. We are heroes, son. Feel me? No matter what field you in, you are a hero, bro. Respectfully, all of you. All you hogs in the comments who got regular jobs and all that, nine to fivers, or you work from home or got your own business, you a hero, son. You a hero to somebody. You probably got kids, and your kids look up to you. You a fucking hero. You hurt respectfully. Swinging hammers in the pouring rain, the snow in the summer. I hope you know that I appreciate your struggle. Thank you to the nurses and doctors fighting for everyone's lives. I don't Max. always find a cure, but I believe that you tried. The guilt of seeing someone who you tried to save die. Mm. Let it haunt you. I know that you're hurt. Some time. And thank you to the priests and the pastors and the grocery store clerks. That's fire. Look at the hog in the background. So, uh, come on, man. Big HOGs, you heard? The ones who don't get thanked are paid enough for their work. Probably feel disrespected, and I'm sure that it hurts. But let me tell you, y'all are heroes for sure. Everyday people, they know who they are. They aren't superstars, and they don't fight evil. They gotta do the hours with no superpowers. Everyday people... Don't always save the world, they don't get the girl. That car hijacking fire too. Hero. You don't need a mask and a cape. I'm gonna sleep on the <laughs> <God>. you... <laughs> Tom, brother man, come on, son. You ain't had to do that. Dude. Like I know you probably did it as a serious thing, <laughs> but this shit is jokes. <laughs> McBatman had a ass boy. <laughs> oh shit. <sighs> Alright, go watch out. Humanity safe for whoa. Whoa. And you don't gotta fly to the moon. Don't need x ray sight to see the This shit is jokes, son. Whoa. Do you think they really went to the moon or was it CGI? Sorry. They know who they are, they aren't superstars, and they don't fight oh, evil. Fine. They gotta do the hours with no superpowers. Everyday people Come dance with me, boy. Come we save the world. They don't get the girl. But y'all are heroes. You a hero too, boy. Heroes. Hey, hey, hey. You a good boy? I love you, man. 
Oh my god, you you, you messing me up. <laughs> yeah, this is good, son. This is a feel good song. I would throw this. I think it's the first real Tom McDonald song that I reacted to that I would throw in a playlist. Respectfully, I like this. One of those days when you're feeling down and you're feeling like, damn, I'm not complete. Damn, life is so hard. You throw this on, you be like, I'm a hero though. You feel me? I got family looking up to me. I think if we all get it into our minds, even though we're cogs in the system, not I'm not talking about like the system, like you know, the government and conspiracies and all that shit. I ain't talking about that. But we are we're cogs and we're the ones that make an America run. We will start looking at each other differently as well. Like, oh, this person right here is doing something in a different field that I'm doing, but it's making the industry run. I'm doing something in a different field than anybody else and then making the industry run. Did, like, <laughs> like, you understand? I think it'll be a more, if we looked at it more, we looked at each other with more, with odds of similarity and then, and then differences. Of course, we got differences. But we are more alike than we are, not respectfully. But anyway, you guys, your boy dips to the deal to the MO. What? <laughs> a few inches later. It's your boy Dips to the deal to the MO. Remember, check your mother piece. Nobody tell you can't do what the fuck you want to do out here. Be the version of you. You can be protect these kids, protect some of this bum ass virus. And always remember, the government is your boy. I love you. I love you. I love you. Peace. Yeah, man. Yeah, shout out to Tom, son. I like this song, man. Keep doing your thing. Big hog gang, you heard? Respectfully, we out of here.